This short presentation explains the myth concerning the pinch grip and its use with computer mice. The two principal forms of grip are pinch and precision, and there are three essential differences between them. The first is that different muscle groups predominate each form of grip. The pinch grip mainly makes use of a group of muscles which are known as extrinsic muscles. These muscles are located in the forearm and control crude movements and produce a powerful grip. The precision grip intrinsic muscles of the hand are entirely located within the hand itself. They are responsible for the fine motor functions of the hand during which little power is produced. A good example of a precision grip is when you position the key into a lock using the intrinsic muscles with little power, but then as you engage the key into the lock and turn, you use a pinch grip which engages the extrinsic muscles with higher power. The second difference is that each grip involves a different type of muscle activity. The pinch grip utilises static muscle activity when an object is grasped firmly in the hand without any movement of the muscles or object. The precision grip utilises dynamic muscle activity when an object is held by the fingertips and moved such as when manipulating a pen. The third and cardinal difference between power and precision grips is that there is very little power generated in a precision grip at all. Pinch grip is a form of power grip. It involves the extrinsic muscles, static muscle activity and a lot of muscle power. The precision grip involves the intrinsic muscles, dynamic muscle activity and little muscle power. To illustrate the difference in power between the two forms of grip, the threshold at which damage appears to occur is 10 newtons, which is just over 1 kilogram. The force to click a mouse button is generally of the order of 75 grams, which is 1 13th or 0.075 of the threshold force required to cause damage. To reduce the force to reposition the mouse, the DXT mouse has a unique and subtle overhang above the thumb that enables the device to be lifted with less force than the button click. If the user were to attempt to hold the mouse too tightly, the mouse will initiate a click, reducing the user's ability to increase the force required to move the mouse. In summary, the DXT has been designed to use the precision grip, does not utilise the pinch grip.